city of Portland and thanks to the float on guys for the great marketing presentation um, such an important part of any business right is marketing reaching the public how do we organize and get people into our center that we're so passionate about um, I am Melanie I'm with at peace flotation spa in Dallas Texas I am a massage therapist by trade I stumbled upon At Peace um, two or three years ago when I moved to Dallas from New Mexico, where I'm originally from, and just fell in love with floating. I started floating there. We have a little different style of um, flotation cabins, we call them, so they're not the traditional tank that we see a lot of. Um, this is our facility in Colleyville. It's, um, you know, just small, intimate. We have two float rooms and three massage therapy rooms, and I also do massage therapy for At Peace there. Um, this is one of our float cabins, so I just wanted to inspire you a little bit um, at where you can go with creating your float center. So I'm assuming if you're sitting in the audience today that you are um, inspired to create a float center, and you've been given a lot of really amazing information to do that. So in addition to our um, spa, our retail spa, we also have a manufacturing company. So we manufacture uh, flotation tubs and install them. Uh, this is ours. We have a rock faux wall on the outside. Uh, this is our first room that we have. Um, so they're really, if you can, I don't know if you can't really tell, but on the bottom right, you'll see a little mat, very bottom right. So the shower's just to the right. So I'll show you a couple of other images of clients that we've had and how the shower sets up really close to that flotation tub, which makes cleaning really, really easy, which is important. Um, this is our other tub, so we have a bamboo cover on this one. So we've designed them both um, kind of, you know, contemporary and upbeat. We have a lot of really bright, vibrant colors in our spa. Um, fairly easy to clean. We can install them with a window or without, we've had people do them both ways. So this is a client of ours out of St. Louis, float in St. Louis. And so you can see on theirs, they have the shower right next to the entrance into the tub, which is amazing because as you all know who have floated, and I'm sure you all have, as soon as you get out, the salt goes everywhere, right? And cleanup is a big issue when you're transitioning from one client coming into the next. So you don't want that spa room to be dirty. You want it to be impeccably clean for that next individual. So the less cleaning you have to do, obviously, the better. Um, also float in St. Louis. I believe they do a lot of networking with um, chiropractors, acupuncturists, mental health professionals. And so um, as they were just segueing kind of into that, it's really, really great to be able to network with other healthcare providers, massage therapists. With our spa, we have three massage therapy rooms, and we have how many Donna therapists now? Eight massage therapists. So we offer, we, we do sell a lot of massage, and the massage is a really great addition to the spa. This is Mountain Float Spa in New York, and I believe they're above a yoga studio, which is really convenient, and they also offer massage therapy. Um, again, the close proximity of the shower, and I really love what they've done with their walls where they just have the decals. So with our spas, you can decorate them however you want, which is kind of cool, and it, it really allows you to engage that level of creativity when you're putting in your space. So they have one that has a rock cover, kind of like ours, and the other one has that really cool tree that I just think is awesome. <laughs> and this is Salt Work, Salt Water Sport and Spa. And I really love their tile work. So they did a really good job with the tile work. These are all our spas, but they've all decorated them a little bit differently. So they have a really beautiful glass shower doors there. Um, again, close proximity to the tub. These guys offer a sports massage. Um, physical therapy, I believe, 
as well as the flotation. So we're starting to see a lot of this integration with uh, flotation therapy with other modalities. And I really love to have my clients come and float first before a massage because the magnesium sulfate is obviously going to relax the muscles, it's going to relax the mind, the central nervous system, and really prepare them to receive more healing work from me when they see me next. So it's just a, such a wonderful complementary therapy. And this is Therapods, and these, these guys have a really cool spin. So they do um, mind, body, and hair, so it's a full-service salon. So you're really only limited by your imagination when you open your facility. Um, I'm sure we're going to get to hear a lot of really interesting stories about um, individuals that have opened spas and where they've led, just like we heard right before I got out here, you know, with all of the art, you know, culminating, the music, um, massage therapy, acupuncture, chiropractic, all of these really interesting things that blend so nicely. Um, another one of our clients is Uncharted Waters Float Center. And this, again, these are just to give you some perspective on all the different things that you can do and all the different designs that are possible with our spas. So just to give you a little bit of information as to what our spas are like, um, where they come from, our spas are all manufactured in Texas. So they're cast in Fort Worth, Texas. The fiberglass tubs are made there. They're shipped over to our facility in Colleyville, Texas, which is only about 15 miles away. Um, at that point, we build out frames for the tubs. Um, so we start there. We do a gel coat on the inside of the tub. We can do those in several different colors. Uh, the most popular we have is a dark blue. Everybody seems to go with that one lately. But we also have a light blue and a tan gel coat on the inside. Um, so we build out the frame, set the tub inside the frame, and then we'll start installing our heat strips. So our personal, our spa, we started with two heat strips on the bottom, and so ours that we provide now have four. We've never had a problem with our heat strips. None of them had ever gone out in eight years, so they're pretty reliable, I would say. And so now you have four that are installed now, so the chances are very, very good that none of them will ever fail you. Um, we also start to drill the holes for the air switch. So we have an air switch for light and we have an air switch for music. Um, we wire the music to an iPod docking station so you can hook up MP3, iPod, whatever. We try to keep it really simple. We don't ha like to have a lot of uh, bells and whistles in our tubs and you don't really need them. I mean the whole experience of flotation is sensory deprivation, restricted environmental stimulation therapy, right? So having, having lights and having amazing music is great, um, but just like Graham was talking about, most people don't want it. Once they experience that silence, that's what people are going for. So they do have the option of turning the lights on or off, um, music on or off from inside our tub. Um, we have, of course, our intake and outtake valves. These are all drilled and installed prior to being shipped. So um, this is what our finished product looks like before we ship it out to our spas. So we have it all insulated, everything's installed, speakers go on the bottom, um, the heat strips go on the bottom, everything's ready to go. And then we'll ship this entire tub to you with the window if you want the window and also the door on top. And then our guys meet the shipment there and come on over to your facility and start installing it. And they'll work with your contractors, they'll work with your electricians, obviously, work with your floor layout. We have a really great group of people in Dallas that are really a joy to work with and great sense of humor as well, which I appreciate. So these are our raw finished products from At Peace. So um, both of these have the window and the door. Some people have opted out of the window um, you can actually do a little bit of customization with the door, can face right, can face left. Um, you can widen it if you wanted to make it, um, you know, handicap accessible or accessible for people who couldn't step up taller. So these are our finished products that you can fill out whatever way you'd like. So the three things that um, we like to say about our spas are we're simple, 
Um, we, like I said, don't have a lot of bells and whistles. We're just the basics, and our prices reflect that. So we have really inexpensive prices. Um, we're reliable. Um, I think in eight years, we've had to replace one pump. So they're very, very reliable. Our pumps are reliable, filters reliable, the tubs are wonderful. They're easy to access if anything goes wrong. It's located right next to it. So everything, you can see everything, right? Um, and best of all, they're affordable. So we have a really, really great price point. Um, we sell one spa installed for $19.5, two installed for $37. So we have really good prices and really good qualities. Thank you.